Hello, daddy folks. It is Diecast Buffet here again. Welcome back to NASCAR Thunder 2004. And if, if you go back to last season, we were down and just out entering Rockingham. Well, folks, that huge win at Phoenix, the maximum points day, and Earnhardt's non-top five finish truly gives us a great opportunity to take the championship into the next mode. Wow, man. 15-point swing we have above him right now. 15 points. It's official. Harvick's out. Uh, Jeff Gordon's out. It is 15 points to decide your Winston Cup champion. Think about this. 2008, here's your champion. 2008, guess what? We finished third. I think Harvick passed us at the last race. I mean, it was incredible. And uh, No, it wasn't Harvick. Who, who got it then? It must have been Tony Stewart. That's right. Freaking Tony Stewart, you idiot. Uh, yeah, he got second there. And this is it. 15 points, two races, get your popcorn. You're going to want to watch this. This is going to be inc incredible racing, man. I mean, I the, the pressure is real. The pressure to win this freaking championship is uh, unbelievable. I, I just don't want to screw it up, y'all. We're going to run the primary paint scheme here at Rockingham. Let's see how the garage is doing. Uh, let's see. we got to get some parts ready. So, we can't prepare our homestay car. The homestay car is already built. We don't have enough time for it, so... As far as I'm concerned, just make sure we have stuff ready for, get this, the next decade. 2010 is the next decade, so take care of your equipment. Our Daytona 500 car is already ready to go. Um, we're going to have to rock this 80 power plant when we get to uh, Homestead. So we're going to take care of the secondary Speedway car. We're going to go ahead and uh, overhaul that bad boy and uh, get that tuned up. The body shop, well, I got a short track car ready to go. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get our secondary uh, Speedway car built up as well. So this is it. You make your bet, you got to lay in it. Our cars for Rockingham's ready. Our car for uh, Homestead 2 is ready. And dates on the next year. So, this is it. I mean, the championship is on the line. Whew. Oh, my good, man. I, 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 I can't believe it, man. We have a shot to win the Winston Cup championship. And um, car rating of 81. We got to go to Rockingham. And, oh, God, we have to take care of the points lead. Here we go, folks. All right, folks, it is absolutely the perfect stage. Me and Dale Jr. on the front row, we got the pole. 15 points separate me and Earnhardt for the Winston Cup Championship. It is going to be must-watch YouTube television. Oh, my goodness. Let's go into the down track side from Rockingham. We're live from the North Carolina Speedway, otherwise known as the Rock side of today's NASCAR race, the Pop Secret 400, right here on MRN. What can you tell us about this track, Barney? Well, this track is deceiving to drivers who are new here. It's wide and fast in most places, but in the corners, they'll have to slow up more than they expect. Otherwise, the wall will sneak up and bite them on the exit, especially in turn two. The 82 car has been mixing it up with some other drivers on the racetrack. If they don't want this to become a problem on the track and with NASCAR, these guys need to use their heads a bit out there. You can rub fenders now and again, but it shouldn't be a weekly occurrence. Dale Earnhardt Jr. has an impressive qualifying record at these speedways. Yeah, that team has made great strides in improving their qualifying setups, and it shows with all the top 10 starts they've made. Tony Stewart will begin the race in the top five in points. Gaining on the leader is tough when you are in the top five in points. It takes you having a good race and the leader having a bad one in order to gain anything substantial. Gentlemen, start your engines. Oh boy, here we go. The championship pressure builds. Now, realistically, me and him can't, we, we, we ain't gonna better win the championship or anything, lock it up. So we know for a fact there's gonna be a battle at Homestead, right? 15 points separate the eight car from the 82. This is going to be one unbelievable championship battle. Oh my goodness, man. I mean, this is it. This is the championship. Two races to go, 15 points separate the front row. There's tension in the air. This is going to be one incredible battle here. I mean, I, I, I the mistakes. What, what would a pit mistake do to this championship? Would it give Earnhardt enough points to take the lead back? Could it put us a lap down with a, a ill-timed caution? I mean, there's just a thousand different scenarios that could happen here. And for us, we need to take care of business here at Rockingham. Junior's going to get a good start here. 
They always get a good start on the outside. Oh, you see that car get loose there, and this is unfortunately going to give Dale Jr. a lap lead. How does this happen, my dude? So not a good start to the race here. Oh, contact with Gordon there. And that's five points to Dale Earnhardt Jr. The first lap he has led in weeks. So that puts the margin to 10 points. Now it's up to us to get back out there, lead a lap, and put it at 15 once again. Our car's kind of loose right there, guys. We're going to have to be really careful off turn two. This is Rockingham. This is a track we've won at before. This is a good track for us. We have to go out here and earn it, though. I mean, we, we just cannot afford to lose points to Dale Jr. And Jr. is in absolute Grand Slam mode. Is Jeff Gordon. Oh, you freaking idiot. You freaking idiot, my dude. Oh, no. Oh, we can't pit here. Dang it, man. Now we're in a box. So me and Jeff Gordon do the Y2C in one and two. Oh, no. This is not good at all. 15-point championship lead, and now throw it in the blender. Lap 7 out of 39 here. We could have pitted there and tried a little bit of strategy, but I'm not willing to do so. We'll just have to go out here and just earn it, man. I mean, we'd, we'd have no choice. We have to go out here and just absolutely earn it. Oh, caution's out. Oh, crap. Contact made there. Dang it. Do we want to pit here? And try something? I don't think so. Let's see. Who got... Oh, Jeff Gordon. Oh, dang. Heavy damage there. Wow. That was a big piece of debris right there. Um, This is going to be on lap 8 here. And um, let's look at the race stats here. So lap 8. It's way too early to pit. No, we, we, we can't pit here. It's way too early. Way too early. So now we got a caution that this, this race is already getting crazy here. We need track position like yesterday. So way too early to pit for a, a fuel uh, pit stop. But we're going to have to be aggressive. I mean, no one is, 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 is our teammate here. There's no teammates. There's no allies. It's all, uh, all take at this point, unfortunately. This is the championship on the line. We have to find a way to get around them and find a way to fight. Get back into contention. Put ourselves back into it. Oh, another caution here. Look, get out of the way, Ashton Lois, you piece of junk. Dang it, man. How do we keep screwing up that corner? <sighs> do we want to pit here, guys? Do we want to pit here? This is way too early for a pit stop, but with us being 29th here, yeah, they've got some gaggles on pit road. I I'm going to pit. I'm going to pit here. I mean, I don't know. Let's see. Do we want to pit? Do we not pit? Do we want to pit? Do we not pit? I don't know. Oh, 171 guy. He's got a huge piece of debris there. So, the current trend is debris cautions. Oh, my God. I, I think we're like three laps outside of our field window because the pit stops here at Rockingham were kind of touch and go. You can kind of be one lap good, one lap out. I'm not going to pit. I just don't think we can pit yet. Season. Oh, we're 89 points out, my dude. We cannot finish at this spot. We cannot. We have to get points. This is unbelievable, man. So if a caution brews now, we can safely pit. But I, I just, I have to get points. I mean, there's no freaking way we can finish like this. We're going to have to just body slam these freaking corners and try to get some spots. We have no choice. Our car's beaten and battered. I'm hoping and praying for another caution here, man. We need a yellow. Equalize the field. That's what we need. We need a yellow. Bobby Labonte blowing up. He's done. So he's going to be out of today's pop secret microwave popcorn 400. Come on, man. We're down to the bottom. We have a good car, man. We qualified on pole. That damage is going to hurt us. But, I mean, if we can just get up to the top 10 and fight. Get out of the way, Jeff Green. Or whoever your name... Oh, oh, okay. Thank you, Steve Park. Thank you, Steve Park. My bad. I had no clue you were going to pit there. My bad, my bad, bro. Oh, fudge, man. I had no clue who was going to pit there, to be honest with you. I should have been looking for that. So everyone's pitting here. It means we're going to have to make a green flag pit stop. Oh, my God. When does Earnhardt pit, man? When does Earnhardt pit? Oh, this guy might be pitting here. Got to be careful. No, he's not. Okay. Duking and diving here. Is Earnhardt still out front? He is. So he's going to get the most laps left. That's another five bonus points to the eight car. And for us, it is... I 
mean, I can't believe we're in this spot to begin with. Still a lot of racing left here at Rockingham, but we have to make a difference. Do we pit early and try to take advantage of these new tires? I don't think so. I think we got to just stay, just keep, keep digging right now. Get everything we can out of it. Do what we got to do. Oh, Lord. I'm just hoping we can catch a caution, man. A caution would be so good right now. Go underneath Kevin Harvick. Good run right there. Car's actually turning pretty good right now, so this is a great opportunity for us. Hello, Robbie Gordon. Excuse me, buddy. Need to get around you. Very loose off the corner. Tenth place here. No Earnhardt pit stop yet. We're not pitting to the eight car pits. We don't have a choice. Uh, Kenny Wass is not going to pit. Thank you, buddy. Okay, uh, Ward Burton, Ricky Craven are down pit road. Caution down! Perfect timing! Yes! Yes! Oh my god. Divine intervention here at Rockingham. Shades of like a Daryl Waltrip, uh, what do they call it, lead shot? Where they freaking have BBs spill on the racetrack? That's basically what it is. That, that could not have been perfect. Right before the stripe, perfect timing, half the field's a freaking lap down. Thank you, Jesus. That was an absolute miracle. Take the time to repair the car. Repair the car. Do what you gotta do. Look, we're gonna have about 15 laps to go here at Rockingham. The current trend show, we could see another debris caution. We need to fix that right front. We gotta put a new hood on it. We gotta take care of the car. Oh my god, man. The championship. I mean, this is truly an insane moment right here. Because Junior's gonna get most laps led today. And we were 15 points good. We're looking at 40 points out. Only thing we can do is go up there and just, just, just beat in a bang with that eight car and try to take the take the win from them. That's all we got to do. It's all we got to do. We got to find a way to get back up there, take, repair the damage, take the time, take your time. 18.9. I'll take it. Look, I'd rather have a car that I can beat and bang with four fresh good years. I like our race car, folks. I like our chances here, man. All right, so absolute miracle caution. But check this out. Dale Jr. was first entering. He's 10th out. So those guys who were able to stay on the lead lap and got that pit stop just absolutely caught a huge break. But could we see anybody who stayed out, maybe? I don't know. Either way, we have to catch that 10 car. So now that actually helps us tremendously because Earnhardt is um, he's 10th place right now. Sure, he's going to car through the field like a turkey on Thanksgiving. But he's going to have a lot of cars to pass with those lap down cars. So right now... I like the situation we're in. The more traffic, the better, because the AI navigates the traffic slower than the AI, uh, than the uh, the player. So, I, I like this. Uh, Gordon's car is in a demolition derby there. I, that was a stupid mistake getting into him early in this race. He's not too happy. He's a 70, so yeah, he'll he'll try to hit us. But we have to catch that eight car, man. I mean, the championship. Get out of the way, Gordon, before you're about to be another caution. Please, just let me go. Oh, no, 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 Gordon. Holy sheesh, man. That Oh, no, no. Dang it. Come on, car, go. Oh, this, the, the pressure, the championship, the points, everything is going insane right now. Come on, car. I, I just need this car to turn, man. I just need this car to turn. We're going to have to overdrive every corner. Everything. Come on, man. I need this car to turn like yesterday. Move. I will put you in the fence if I have to. If you block me, I will dump you for this caution. You got to do what you got to do here. Rockingham, 10 to go. Championship on the line. What would the picture be when we go to Homestead? Dale Jr. is carving through him. He's up to the fifth place. I think Michael Waltrip didn't pit. So something's out of the ordinary here. Get out of the way, Mayfield. I ain't got time for your crap right now, bro. Get out of my way. I will put you in the fence, buddy. This idiot trying to bang fenders with us, man. Look, man, if you're slower than me, get out of the way. I'm sorry, Kyle Petty. I respect the crap out of you, but we have way more important things to race for right now. Okay, that's another position. Look, beat and bang. Do what you gotta do. Do what you gotta do. Come on, let's go. Let's go, car. Gosh, dog it, man. I'm frustrated right now. I'm so sorry, Kyle Petty, but I, I need this spot right now. 
Oh, this is frustrating. Oh, come on, just just go, car, please, for the love of God, put this 57 in the fence. There we go, get around him, there we go. 57, we got around him. Oh, Jesus, we gotta get around this 30 car. He's gonna try to bozo McGee as the bottom, or the, 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 the right rear is very weak right now, so we gotta take care of that. Huge launch off the corner here. That's another position right there, that two car. I think the 97, yeah, the 97 and that 20 are for position as well. So every spot we get is just really important right now. Oh my gosh, come on car. For the love of God with this car, please just, I need it to cooperate right now. Cars are pitting, so that's extra points for us, but also extra points for Earnhardt. Right now, put a Band-Aid on it. That's what we got to do. Just put a Band-Aid on it. We passed two right there in the lap. Uh, the, the one and two. That's huge. I'll take it. Position seventh right now. We need to pass the 20, possibly the 17. Look, I I'm doing everything I possibly can right now to gain as much spots. There we go. Another one. Kins, if, if you block me, you're going to be... Oh, buddy. Do not block me, man. He blocked me, okay? I'm racing for a championship. I don't care, Kins. I'm sorry, buddy. I respect the crap out of you. But I'm going for a championship right now. Those five points right there will pay huge dividends if we can hold on to it. Possibly is Newman on the lead lap? I don't know. Who will be racing? Oh, Newman. Okay. We got to move Newman. Look, Newman is... We need to get around him. Cleanly. Cleanly. Gosh, dog it. I can't get off of him. Oh, no. This is not what we need. Not what we need right now. Newman can take us out. And that would be the end of the day. Newman's going to die bomb, move us off the racetrack. Oh my gosh. This is just the absolute nightmare. We need these points. Newman is he's a rival. This is not good. I need these five bonus points. And Newman, I'm about to take them from you. Come on, just get around him before he hits us. There we go. Thank you for hitting me square in the door. Okay. There's Kenseth. Come on, come on, car. Come on. Come on, move Kenseth if you have to. Do what you gotta do, buddy. Do what you gotta do. Come on, we gotta get Kenseth here. Come on, baby. Come on, come on. Get to the bottom. Get to the bottom. Thank you, Jesus. Fourth place, baby. I will take it. <sighs> Earnhardt just won Rockingham. But we kept our championship hopes alive. What a freaking race right there, man. That went to heck in a handbasket. Holy crap, my dude. Wow, man. We had a demolition derby the field. We had to do what we had to do. We had to save our championship hopes. And as of right now, it's 185 points to Dale Hart Jr. So here is your championship outlook heading to Homestead. We lose the championship points lead. Oh my God, man. I mean, how did we survive that race, my dude? So Jr. literally dominates the race, leads half the race. Um, God, That was crazy right there, man. We had four cautions, eight lead changes. So we have 160 points. He has 185. We, we had 15, so let's do the math here. So he had 185. That's a 25 point uh, plus gain here. Our 15 points though will save us, and that will actually cut it down to 10, I think. So if, if I am mistaken, if we go to Homestead and we lead the most laps, we win the championship. This truly could been could be uh, Carl Edwards, Tony Stewart, 2011, all over again. Yeah, because our he had 25 points gained there. We had 15 in the bank. So that would put it down to just 10 points. 10 points, you lead the most laps, that's what it is. 10 points, so. Oh my god, man. I mean, we almost lost that. Look, I'm sorry, Kinziff. I'm sorry, Gore. I'm sorry to anyone we had to hit out there, except for Newman, because he's hit us plenty of times. But I, I love Newman in real life, but not in this playthrough. I had to move Kinziff there. You want to know why? Because that's five bonus points right there, my dude. That's huge. I had to move Newman. That's five bonus points. That was 10 points we gained and saved right there. You got to do what you got to do. So let's look through the field here. Who is the bottom of the barrel? Unfortunately, Bobby Labonte with the engine failure. Robbie Gordon, not a good run. And Kevin Grubb. Wow. 
Thank you all so much for watching. The next episode is going to be absolutely insane. Junior controls his own destiny. Ten points separate Earnhardt versus Hodge for the championship. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll upload these every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday, 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So you know, uh, whatever day it is right now, uh, well, guess what? With the next day out of those four I mentioned, uh, that will be the championship episode. The pressure is real. It's going to be one wild homestead race to settle the Winston Cup. Thank you all so much for watching. Have a blessed one. Die Kiss Buffet, signing off.